Okay, how's everyone doing? How's everyone doing today? Well, today, I actually have a bit of a new thing to do. See, as you can see, I'm playing a new game called Map of Materials. Uh, this is an indie game, and the funny thing about this game is that um, I didn't even pay for it. Oh, it costs money to play, but I did, but I got it for free. No, I didn't pirate the game. No, the developer for this game actually reached out to me, as well as a lot of other YouTubers and streamers, and uh, he asked me to cover the game for him to help him get it get help get the game some exposure. Now I am going into this game completely blind. Uh, basically, it's supposed to be an open world exploration focused RPG. Uh, based on the limited reviews on Steam that I've read about this game, it seems like it's uh, got a bit of a clunky control scheme to it. But otherwise, it's a nice nostalgia trip for, I'm assuming, the late 90s and early 2000s, because that's what the graphics on the title screen remind me of. So, um, he's, the, a lot of people said that this game might have been actually, might have actually been worth a purchase if it were just a little bit cheaper. Last I checked, and admittedly I haven't checked in a couple of days, but this game is supposed to sell for $14.99 on Steam, and some people say, hey, if you just made it like five bucks or less, it would actually be worth a damn. So, uh, so to the developer, if you're watching, and I assume you are, because... Well, I mean, you're not watching right now, I can see that you're not in the chat, but if when I transfer this thing to YouTube, uh, and you go and watch that, keep that in mind. Over on my channel, there was a game I played 20 minutes of called Zup F. Hello, Gelmerv. Uh, thank you for complimenting my beard. And uh, he, basically, I said that that game was actually worth keeping. I wasn't going to refund it, even though it wasn't an incredible game, because it was only 99 cents. Your sales would probably go through the roof if you priced this game accordingly, assuming that I agree with everything you... with what these reviews are saying. So, with that said, I'm... you kind of look like Theoden from Lord of the Rings. Uh, I've never seen Lord of the Rings, so I'm just going to take your word for it. Anyway, Let's get ahead. Let's get around to doing what the developer wanted me to do when he gifted me this game. Let's actually get around to playing it. A Rain on Thirty game. That's the name of the developer. Is Rain on Thirty? It seemed to be the only way. He had no other choice. Ooh. His plan was clear, but he lacked the material. He was being followed and didn't survive. So I'm playing as an undead guy? Years later, a different place, a different man. A new beginning. Huh. So... And he doesn't even know how trapped he is. Huh. So... I'm playing as some guy trying to finish some long dead guy's vision? Check your notes in or read one of your found notes. Hmm. I'm gonna have to keep that in mind. Um, graphics are a bit outdated, but artistically speaking, that's a nice little landscape you got drawn there. Alrighty. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, let's go. Uh, stuck at 99% loading. Oh, dear. Well, while we're waiting for this thing to load, let's see if I can find, uh... Okay, never mind. Uh, what? 
What's happened? Where am I? A beach? Note added. Looky, look around here. Okay, so that's not so much a note as it is a fourth wall breaking uh, to instruction. Okay, open your inventory with tab. Hover over the tile to read your effects. Okay, collect experience. Got it. Uh, yeah, I totally don't need that. Need to be told that. Okay. Skill points can be spent here in strength or agility. Hmm. Uh, I only have the two stats. Here you can see your health, food, and water. Blocking increases your food consumption. Sprinting increases water consumption. Health is red, orange is food, blue is water. Okay. Um, just a heads up, red and orange kind of look the same. You might want to update that in a patch. It's, um, make it some totally different color, like green or something. Here you will find your collected items. Uh, some items, yeah, got it, got it. Okay, here you can create new items. Hmm. You can drag an armor in here. That's it. All right. Game saved automatically. Okay. So, got a coconut. Ah, okay, so this is going to be my food to start with. Hmm. Seashells. Can't pick up the seashells, it seems. Hey, turtle. Can I... How do I attack? Can I... Attack with sword. Left mouse button. Block with sword. Got it. Can you unban my... Uh, no. He deserved it. I banned him for a reason. Oh, loot chest. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, and it got an axe. Nah. Healing potion, old water, stone, coconut. Hmm. Simple bow. Open damage and agility add up to total damage. Hmm. Okay. Alright, turtle, you're going down! Ugh. Loop turtle. What, uh, raw seafood. So I get seafood from a turtle. That's kind of weird. Anyway. Hmm. Oh, I need a pickaxe for that. Okay. If he wants to, um contact me directly and he can go in to uh, he can make his own uh, he can make his own unban request need a pickaxe for that Whew. uh pick a coconut Okay, so I got enough supplies, it seems, or I got it. I, I pretty much got everything from this section, from this beach that I think I'm ever gonna get. I need a, I need to get a pickaxe to do anything more, but there doesn't seem to be a pickaxe here on, uh, on the beach. All right, so I can enter the water, it seems. Where does it? There are sharks. Oh, yeah, thanks for the heads up, game devs. <sighs> mm. Okay. Uh, 
Oh. Oh, you're still... Okay, I need a stone and I need a wood. I wonder, can I... Three, four. Hmm. Got wood. Okay. Ah, oh, let's craft one of these. Oh! Hmm. Okay, I think I see it. I think I see what I do here. Okay, I can craft... 16 of these. Now. <sighs> Cannot be placed here. Okay. Use the campfire. Fried meat. Fried bug meat. Ah! Okay, so I boil that water. Mmm. Okay. Now. Okay, that's. Two, three, four. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Now. Got wood. Simple bow, axe. Hmm. Oh, okay, I see. Okay, so... Hmm. I was gonna just grab this... the fucking... seawater and then go to the campfire to boil it. Okay. Fucking assholes in the chat telling me to give fucking racist ass comments. Not gonna lie, not a huge fan of the fact that uh, these palm trees stay in the game even after I've. Uh, even after I've extracted all the wood from them. I sh I mean, uh, there should be like a tree falling animation, then the tree can just fade into nothingness, and then I just get the wood. That would be an ex- that would not actually be a nice way of keeping track of which trees I've already chopped down. Just, uh, throwing that out there for its own sake. Just, uh, you, a you asked me to- uh, review this game for you. I'm just throwing this out there. That is that is just my opinion. Obviously, it's your game. You can do what you want with it. I don't care. I mean, I, I got this game for free, so there's no reason for me not to keep it. But it, this is just, like, see, I, I walked up to this tree, and only when I got close enough did I notice I had already chopped it. So, it would be nice if the tree just went away all together uh just for that hmm okay there's some sharks uh i guess i need to do some rock climbing hmm okay i'm starting to see what the reviews were talking about when they said that the, that the controls were a bit jerky. There are sharks. There are sharks. Oh, okay, so the game won't even let me go that way. I seem to be trapped here. 
which What is this? Oh, that's the iron vein from earlier. <sighs> Vial of resin. Fresh water or snow. Let me see if I can, uh, kill the sharks with a bow. I wonder, could I do that? Doesn't- There are sharks. Doesn't seem to do anything. No, that doesn't seem to do a damn thing. All right. Okay, look around here. Yeah, that that is. I told me to just. Uh, the, anytime I got stuck, check the notes. Well, I checked them, and all it says is look around. I mean, I don't know what else to do. I've looked around. What, uh... The, this looks like a ship shipwreck. Hmm. That must be the boat that landed that I was on. And I got... Uh, I, uh, how am I? Su I'm supposed to get up there somehow. But. For some reason, it seems to be uh, gated off to me. I get the feeling that this is where I'm supposed to go. Ugh. Need a. Look, bro, this game, I get, if you're trying to go for a nostalgia trip, maybe your, maybe your game's, game's notes need to be a bit more, uh, push in the right direction-y. Because all you're saying right now is, look around, and frankly, I've done that. As you can clearly see... I have no idea where to go. I've looked all around the area. I've combed every inch of this beach that I started on, and... <sighs> I can only assume I'm supposed to go up there. Up here, and then climb these rocks so that I can get over there. That's the best I can... There are sharks. That's the best I can do. I've tried uh, shooting the sharks from afar. That didn't work. I've tried climbing up here. I've tried climbing the rocks elsewhere. I'm sorry, but I, I really, I'm really am trying. The game just doesn't give you any sense of direction. The game literally just says, oh, hey, go look no around. I am sorry, but, uh, you say if we need to get stuck, check your notes? Well, I checked. The notes don't tell me jack shit. So what's the point of having that hint system if it doesn't give me any damn hints? Ah. <sighs> <sighs> 
<sighs> you know, I prom. I said I would stream for at least an hour. I swear, I d I meant to. But uh, I I I'm not gonna spend an hour just running around in circles like this, without making any progress. I'm sorry. I gave this game a fair shake. But I, I I'm sorry, but unless you got something you unless you if if you want to offer me a better if you want to like update this this game in a patch, and uh, tell me. Uh, and just give a better sense of direction. Maybe update the notes system so that you can, uh, so, so that I can, uh, so that it actually tells me what to do in case I get stuck on something. Then yeah, I, I'll give this game a second chance. I'll still be keeping it. I didn't pay for it, so there's no reason for me not to keep it. Uh, but until then, I, I see no reason to bore everyone to tears just walking around the same confined beach for an hour. Just because I said in advance, before I realized how, how stuck I would be, that I would play for at least an hour. I'm sorry. So, I'm sorry, but this game just, um, I, I just do not recommend this game to anyone. Because it just doesn't feel like there's any... Because I just can't fit... Because I, if you can't get out of the first literal fucking room of the game, chances are you need to go back to the drawing board. <sighs> I'll be... St so tomorrow I'm going to restart the stream of WWE 2K22 My Rise, and I'm going to start doing the women's My Rise. So until then, I'm Acer Thorn, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!